Hi, this is Brandy from Acer Service. On a previous video, I showed you how to use a USB flash drive to create a recovery backup. Now I want to show you how to use that USB flash drive to restore your computer back to factory defaults. The first thing you need to do is make sure that your computer is off and your USB recovery drive is plugged in. Now go ahead and turn it back on, and as soon as you see the very first Acer screen come up, tap the F2 key. You should see it load into the BIOS. Along the top of the screen, you'll see a few tabs. Use the arrow keys on your keyboard to move over to boot. You'll see a numbered list of devices here. The device you're looking for in the list is USB HDD, and then it should have a model name after it. You can see mine here, along with the model name. This needs to be the first thing in the list. If it already is, then you're fine and you can leave it. If it's not, just use your arrow keys to move down and highlight it, and then tap F6 to move it up the list. Once it's in the first spot, use your arrow keys to move over to exit at the top of the screen. Exit saving changes should already be highlighted. Press enter, and then press enter again to save the changes. The computer will restart and load into the recovery drive. When it comes up, it will ask you to select a language. Go ahead and do that. On the next screen, click on Troubleshoot. And on this screen, select Reset Your PC. It's going to let you know that everything on your computer is going to be deleted. If there are things on it that you need to save, now would be the time to back out of this and do so. When you're ready, click Next. And here, click on Windows 8. It'll ask you if you want to repartition your PC's hard drives. This allows you to restore the internal recovery partition that came with your computer if you had previously removed it. If you want to leave the partitions the way they are, just select No, which is what I'm going to do. It'll present you with two options. Both will still delete all of your computer's data, but the second option, Fully Clean the Drive, is a more secure way of doing it, though the process will take a lot longer. Click on whichever option you'd like. I'll use the Just Remove My Files option. It'll warn you one more time that everything on your computer is going to be removed. When you're ready, click Reset. Your computer will start going through the restore process, keeping you updated with its percentage along the way. Once it's done, it'll reset and load back into the recovery screen. At this point, remove your USB drive and click Continue to exit and boot back into Windows where you'll need to progress through the first time setup. If you have any questions, please visit our website at support.acer.com.